Hello there. How is everybody doing this week? It's Neasy again. And just in case you forget my name. It's there just for you to remember my name. <laughs> Do you know I've had this for years? I used to work on night shifts in the care profession. I worked 30 years in the care profession. Half of those um, years were spent on night shift. And so I made myself a little eye patch thing. And just to be, you know, sparkly, even back then, I put an easy on it. I smell Neasy different ways. The reason why it's spelt this way is because this is the original way. But because people can't pronounce it properly, like a few of those at Slimming World, you know who you are. Um, they call me Nessie. <laughs> But it doesn't have two S's in it. So I don't know where they get that from. So sometimes I pronounce it N double E Z double E. Because then they get it. Anyway. I'm here because it's Slimming World Night. And it's time to do my makeup. So I'm going all gold. I've got my gold top on. Gonna put my goldy makeup on. So, here we go. I'm all primed. Not ready. Hang on. Not ready at all. Got no concealer out. Let's get the concealers out. Oh, I'll get them out later. Right, let's put a bit of this on. Let's get doing. Because what are we up now? I don't know what that number is at the side of it, but... It says 223 and 33.30 and oh I don't know what that is. Anyway, here goes. Putting my technique on to cover any blemishes on my eyelids. It's just to cover them, that's all. If I have any. Helps the eyeshadow stick a bit better and all. Although I did put my eyeshadow on the other day and it were alright. Well, I've got to use it up. It's in cupboard. Once it's used up, I can throw it away. I shall be getting a better one than this. It's all right, but it's only again what you pay for. Mm -hmm. Like I've said, going to be getting my kit next week. Well, I don't know how long it will be, but I'm going to be paying for it next week. Um, From Unique. Oh, yes, I am. I'm getting it. And you know, her Lucy, she's proper good. She says she's not, you know, she says she's not bothered, but she's dead supportive. Really supportive. Thank you, my little Lulu. So yeah, I can't wait to um to try all these unique products. And I shall be giving my honest opinion. I shall. It is absolutely leathering it down outside. And I've also been told on the weather, there's a storm coming tonight and it'll happen when we're sat in Slimming World. There'll be a nine force whatever gale, hurricane. It'll be monsoon it down with rain and we'll be stuck in St Cuthbert's. But it is a pub, so at least we'll be all right for beer. As long as they don't run out. So, yeah. There we go. Put some of my old tart on for the old tart. For the old grey eyes. Just to brighten them up. How's everybody's week been? Mine's not been three bad, actually. I've been busy again painting not the bedroom this time the kitchen 
I keep getting now, Lisa, coming in going, so what, what do you have planned? She has no idea what I have planned. I'm not telling her either. It's just going to happen. <laughs> you know what I mean? What can you do? Right, I shall be putting my base. So I'm going to go, because I'm going all gold, <laughs> I wish. I'm putting my Huda, here it is. I love this, and I forget its name every time. Huda Beauty Rose Gold Edition um, palette. <laughs> so, let's put a bit of bay on. Let's get some um, a bit of base colour going. Started using mobile as my mirror. My mirror's at si right at side of me here. Yeah. Hang on, I'll use the mirror. It is so dark. I can hardly see. And I won't put any lights on. Because when I like filming, I like filming in with natural light. Otherwise, you get sort of like... you don't. Well, obviously you don't get natural light then if you don't. <laughs> I'm going to have to get some fancy camera and... I mean, I'm using my mobile phone. And they say that, you know, these video... Video making now is just as good on your mobile phone. But I want a nice swanky camera with, you know... Like I look like I'm filming. Woohoo! Like a movie star. You know, with the lights behind you, you know, and all the umbrellas. No, I don't want all that. But I do want a decent camera. Because this thing is awful. It can. It probably cut out halfway through now. And then I have to join the two videos up together, which is a ball ache. So, anyway, keep going, with Neasy. Right, what am I doing next? Let me find a brush. That's a purpley brush. Um, let's find a brownie brush. A brownie brush. Does anybody in the brownies when they were younger? I know I was. And I was in the guides. Do you know, it's funny really. It's true what they say, you know, if you're in the guides and everything, it does teach you. They do teach you when you're in the... It's good. It's good for the kids. Brownies, guides, scouts. It's good for them. Good for the kids. Right. I'm going to go for the next colour. Which is a bit of shy. Which I am not. Used to be though. Used to be very shy me. Very shy indeed. What's that? Wrong bloody brush. <laughs> oh, I thought it felt dead thick. Right, putting my colour on with the right brush. That's a nice brown. So, yeah, there we go. That's a bit of shy for you. So what's people been doing? Like I say, I've been painting kitchen. But there comes a time. Do you know, I shouldn't really admit that. I haven't been painting the kitchen at all. I've just been busy. That's all. But. The kitchen is getting renovated <laughs> as we speak. My girls are busy with their rollers and they're doing a little bit of polish pebble, the same colour that I used in here for just doing the furniture. Easy doing the furniture. You can sit on a chair and do it. Which I did because I sat up bed half the time. It's an awful day. Bucketing it down. 
bucketing. What's that now? Things popping up at the top of the mobile. Distractions for me. Right, so a bit of suede. Oh, I don't, don't think I've used that before. So I shall use that. I'm going to put that in the crease because it's a nice dark brown. Oh, here we go. It's always a bit dodgy when it starts putting a bit of a darker colour. Some people, when they're putting the, um, the darker colour in the crease, you don't have to go all the way to the corner like I do. I'll show you on this one what some do. All you have to do, and forget all that, what I've just put on. If, you've, you, if you're just putting on like a light eyeshadow and you don't really, you need to conceal the, you need to get my sort of illusion, but on a smaller scale. All you have to do is just put, like, oops, done that wrong because I'm doing it. Oh, hang on, right, I'm on mirror. So put like a sort of diagonal there and then just in the where the crease is just do about an inch there like that so just do about an inch and use that there can you see it's still giving that do you see what i mean whereas i'm going all the way over here you know me um, I can do that because of the shape of my eyes. A lot of people can't do it because of the shape of their eyes. But obviously I can. Got two lines there. God knows why. Let's fill that in. But you can still get the illusion there with just being in the corner. Easy peasy. Okay. You know, because you, you must watch these videos and think, Neither, how can you do the crease without going all the way like you do over to the corner? Because some people are not doing enough as me. Or they just don't like wearing a lot of makeup. Do you know what I mean? Each to their own. Each to their own. You do it as you want to do it. But these are the tricks of the trade. And they never fail. If you want... Can you see how that now is, is drawing away? Because now if I put a light concealer here, it just draws that, that crease away. It's just all... Like I say, illusions. You know, and put something. Now I'm going to have to wipe that because. Get my towel out. My towel. I get. I always have a towel handy just to wipe my brushes quickly. Oh, look at that now. Come down off of there, you monkey. <laughs> right. I shall redo that. Hang on, that's because I weren't concentrating that. Right, so put your lightest cats playing up around my legs. Oh, there's always a distraction when I come to do my videos. I could never do my videos in peace and bloody quiet there we go so that's blended in okay sir edward numpty edward you will look at me <laughs> right so i'll do i'll do uh, so i'm going to put my nice color on now what i'm putting on and do you know what I'm putting on? <laughs> Gold. That's what I'm putting on. <laughs> oh, I could just totally forgot what I was doing then. Oh, my Lord. It's a good job, I think, sometimes on my feet. Sometimes, knees it. On your feet's the best way. <laughs> 
clean that brush that brush is a bit dirty i'm going to have to have a brush cleaning day where all these brushes get cleaned um i can't find a bloody brush now here we go that might be okay okay we're going for gold we'll go for a bit of 24 carat i think oops it's quite powdery here we go right though So Lucy's boyfriend is coming back tomorrow, so we're all happy and jumping about in the house. She's all happy that her, you know, other half is coming home. I've just been happy to have her all to myself this week. Because when, you know, when they're with a partner... You don't get that time anymore. Because they concentrate on them, don't they? So it's been nice to have Lucy all to myself this week. Even though she's been moping half of it. Pining. Oh, pining after a little boy. Eh, uh, well, he, apparently he's been the same. <laughs> They've both been like apart and just, as they say, absence does make the heart grow fonder. That's a very true saying. Right, I'm going to do some patching up now from what I did before. Correct him on my mistakes. That rain isn't cooling down, it's not stopping while I'm here up in my bedroom. In my little studio, doing my makeup video, talking to the world on my camera. I hope one day somebody will see my videos and really like them and then send me lots and lots of lovely makeup. That would be nice. As I could do what the other girls do. Oh, like you know when when I do with my butch box. Looks what I got. And then you can prod it review and oh they've sent me this today. I don't get anything like that. But it would be nice if I did. Cause then I could stop, you know. Just a minute. Edward, what are you doing? Oh my god. Oh. He's not right in the head. He eat too many mice. It must it just must send them funny. It must just be the mice. Let's get a baby wipe. Cause my eyes look mucky over there. Oh, somebody's tried ring but a block number. So it's just popped up with Let's clean that up a little bit So it looks nice So there we go Bit of gold today Girlies and boysies Put some more gold in that corner now That's it Get a bit. I like to get a bit of. If it's a nice colour, I like to bet, get a bit in the corners of my eyes as well. I think that makes it look really, really nice. See, like that. Keep your eyes closed though when you're doing it because it can get quite mucky and in your eyes. Okay then, so they get, so they. Always remember to put a bit of powder under your eyes as well. The prop, the shadow that you've been using for your crease would be nice because look how nice that goes together. 
Ah, Lucy, when she sees me in browns and golds, she always says, you, you really suit these colours, Mum, and, and I've always suited these colours. It's just greens that I don't gel well with. Plus, when you put powder underneath your eyes, it's sort of when you go to put your eyeliner on, it sort of sits there better and lasts there longer. There you go, see? That looks nice, doesn't it? I'm on 20 minutes already and all, all I've done is my eyes. But I've got to that point now. But but wait, yeah, because I've got to do the top bit. That's a bit hard. What's that? That looks a nice one. Um, I'm going to do a bit of moon dust up here. Just a tiny bit. Just going to do one to show you. Some shit. You need a shiny highlighter at the top. Because that then will bring all the colours together then. Because all I've used today is three colours. Gold, brown and another gold but it's a lighter gold. And then I'll highlight, I'll blend all that in so you can't actually see. Sometimes I like to see the lines because I like, I, I don't know what it is. I just like to see the lines, but I'll blend it all in and it'll look great. I'm going to get off now. I'm going to pause it. I'm going to do my eyebrows um, in my black and I'm going to put my eyeliner on and I'm going to put my false lashes on. Oh, and I'm going to put my eyeliner on top of, still going to put my eyeliner on top of my eyes. And then, then I'll be back from to put my foundation on. So I'll see you in a jiffy, okay? Look at those babies. Woo! <laughs> now I've not done one eye because I wanted to show you. Now I'll put some concealer in that eye before, but sometimes when you're putting your eyeshadow on and you're rubbing all, because I'm a mess, you know that I'm a messy eyeshadower. So I'm rubbing it off. So later on what I do is I go off and find your favourite highlighter, the one that you love the most, the lightest and brightest. And mine's always sleek. I must admit, I do love sleep. So just get your highlighter. And I've got, it's called Solstice Pack. I don't know how to pronounce it. Solstice, S-O-L, S-O-L-S-T-I-C-E, Solstice. God only knows. But anyway, I love that sleek. So I get some of that and pop it in the corner of your eye like this. I'm just going to use the mirror, girlies. Because I need to get it right. And then just blend it in there. If you have to close your eyes for a minute because you've got your falsies on. If not, you're all right. Blend it in there. Can you see how that's really lightened? I've already blended that in. But can you see how that's brightened that corner of the eye up? And that's what you do. That's another trick of the trade. Let's blend that out like that, see? When I put my foundation on, it'll rub out anyway. But if you can can get the highlighter in that corner, if you suffer from doubt, I do. I have to do this all the time. I don't do it because I like doing it. I do it because I have those dark circles. And you just pop a bit of, of highlighter in there to make it look unnatural. As though, you know... That you look like you wake up in the morning looking like that. No way, baby. <laughs> right. 
so the next job is I've I've siliconed my face. I haven't siliconed. I've primed my face as well while I've been off camera, so I can just get straight onto the foundation. And sometimes I find I get a little bit red. I start like flushing up on the cheeks. So sometimes you always need these come in handy, and they're either be not BB CC color corrective creams, and sometimes put a little bit on just there where the redness is flaring up and just blend it in where's my brush just blend it in before I put my foundation on because sometimes when I'm putting my makeup on I start to burn up like a Bunsen burner my cheek start to feel like they're on fire. I don't know why it does it. It's just, just stupid. But it's is that what happens? Right, put a couple of pumps of my number seven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know it, girlies. So I'll do my top first. Put that back. And... get it now I'm using my brush today because I feel like it because I feel like it right there as well it's like making a painting but with your face I mean sometimes I mean I think like that sometimes you have to go off camera and you have to practice. I mean, all my makeup that I've got rid of, I've given it to her, Rebecca. She's eight. And I mean, she's not really there yet, but she's going to be. And I remember when I was telling you in the, my last video, I remember my mum was an Avon lady. She was an Avon lady for years. And back then, it was just, it was, it was sort of like a hobby for women. It was, it wasn't now like where, when I went to the job centre once. Um, well, I don't think I was at the job centre. I think I was at one of my benefit places. And I noticed Avon, no, on the board, and I went, "You put this Avon down as a job. It's a job now." And I went, you're joking. You class Avon ladies as a job. And she went, yeah, it's a job now. You can, if you go, if you be an Avon lady, you've got a job. I went, I was like that. Well, I, I'll go to the foot of our stairs. Never before in our, in memory, you know, have I ever known Avon to be a job it's just always something women have done because they wanted to do you know what i mean girlies well now it's officially a job so you can't even do it for like i can't do it now because it's a job i've got to watch going on this unique thing because it's a job it's not a job but it, it, it's a business. You can go into it and be a business. But Lisa's already told me that you don't have to go in to be a business. You can do it where you accrue, where you get free makeup. So I said, I'll sign up. As long as it's free makeup, as long as I get it paid back in free makeup, I'll sign up. I says, there's got to be no money exchanged in hands or anything. You've just got to do it. Otherwise, you get... You know, I mean, I'm doing these videos. <laughs> I'm doing these videos. I'm doing these videos. And I'm yabbiting on. And they can go on these videos and look and listen to what I talk about. Do you know what I mean? 
and then the next minute you'll be getting a letter through. So nobody's grassing you up. I've grassed myself up. So, right, that is number seven. Love it, me. Just love it. Gives me that nice dewy look. But the, I'm going to be putting some powder on top of it in a minute. I just feel like leaving it like that sometimes. It is it? I love it. Oh, Lucy put me onto this. Number seven. It is really good makeup. I love number seven. But yeah, I've put a bit of colour correcting on underneath because I'm flaring up. You know. And that's how it goes. So now I've got to get the the powder out the winter powder oh my god and i got loads out from last time so here we go with powder oh sorry darlings maybelline fit me Ding. uh yeah so yeah she was an avon lady and she had um like a wardrobe set thing in a room because she had the biggest room i was mum's have the biggest room don't they just putting me me towel down there because I, I can feel my powder going everywhere and in this top drawer in a wardrobe it was absolutely aving with makeup absolutely chock a block with makeup and i'll never forget what my stepdad said to me when um he caught me in me i was in my mum's bedroom sat up bed you know just thinking and he come in and i just got up and i was walking out and he said no it's okay and he said come here and he took me over to this drawer and I'd loved this drawer so much because it was full of makeup and that day he said he opened the drawer and he said all oh, this is yours now and it was a it was a massive massive drawer it was a nice big um you know them old dressing table fancy dressing table sets that they used to have with big drawers at the top well, it was like that, and it and she had all her Avon makeup in there, all bought and paid for. And he just turned around and he said, "It's all yours, this now." And I just said, "I'd rather have my mum." Do you know? But I got all this makeup, loads of it, and that's when it started. So I was twelve. I was 12, Data, because that was the day. That was the day I grew up. I was not a child anymore. So there you go. Because I remember my stepdad saying to me, you go half it, do everything that your mum did. Keep us going. You'll have to look after us now. And I looked at him and I said, I can't do that. I'm not my mum. That was her job. And I don't know what happened, but suddenly I started finding a voice from nowhere because I was always the quiet one. And I was always the one that never said boo to a goose. I was always, you know... My mother was a very large character as well, so I'm not surprised I've ended up like I have. But I thought, I can carry on like my mum. Yeah, cooking. She used to bake every Sunday. I don't know about anybody else, but on a Sunday, loved Sundays me. Because you'd get Sunday dinner and you'd get it at dinner time. So you'd get it for about half twelve, one o'clock. A full roast dinner. Sat at the table. No talking. No laughing. And if you wanted to get up from the table, you had to say, 
May I leave the table, please? Mm. I was brought up properly, you know. I weren't dragged up. I were brought up. <laughs> yeah, so... Do that with your, your bronzer. To get your line. Uh-uh. And, um, and then on a Sunday, when she'd finished toiling over the Sunday roast and you got everything. Yes. So where was I? Yeah, gave me this big drawer of makeup and I just thought yeah so that was what I was talking about I do apologise my video went off and I had to sort it out so anyway yeah so after her cooking a Sunday roast slaving over a hot stove she would then bake all afternoon you would get cherry pies, um, jam, do you remember jam tarts, um, you'd get them, you'd get, oh, you'd get sandwiches for your tea, um, and you'd get, you just get all these good thing cake, oh, you'd get a Victoria sponge, oh, my mum, she did spoil us and I think that's where I get my baking from and at least he gets it too at least he's a, a patisserie chef did you know that very proud of our Lucy I'm very proud of both my daughters they are both amazing and individual in their own way in this world and I like that. Right, I'm going to put my blush on now. I've just put my uh, all-time favourite Arabian Glow Pearls. And I'm not going for my new Rimmel. Um, not Rimmel. I'm going for the Rimmel. I'm not going for my new Benefit one. I don't know. Oh, for God's sake. I have to get a camera. It's Bloody mobile phone. It's done my head in this afternoon. Try that video. All I want to do is just video for, what, half an hour, <laughs> she says. So, um, yeah, and she'd be, and she'd set the table up. And you know, you'd, we all have one of them drop leaf tables. They still make them today. Drop leaf tables so that it can be pushed away to the wall. So you had lots of room in your kitchen. Because we used to have... You remember them racks that they used to hang all the washing on? We had that go... Uh, as you went down into the into the bathroom, the rack was uh, over the top there. It was like a little hallway. And um, that's where we dried. And my mother, she used to have a paraffin heater. Them awful paraffin heaters. It used to... We used to put that on. When we'd had a bath, we used to come out and the paraffin eater used to be on full blast. You'd be like fuming with gas and everything. Oh, I don't know, I survived me. I really don't. Because then paraffin eaters were bloody lethal. They wouldn't be allowed today, them bloody things. I'm telling you, paraffin eaters. Oh my God, you could smell the paraffin. When she first slid it up, you were like that. <coughs> and she's go, oh, gee, oh, get yourself dried. Get yourself dried and get your pyjamas on. Oh, my God. But, yeah, that was every Sunday. It was always bath night, ready for school Monday morning. Bath done, her washed. A bath, her washed. All that baking done with full tummies. Yeah, those were the happy memories of my mum. You know, happy memories. We've all got them. And it's great talking about them. Because I'm losing the light, me. I best hurry up. I'm going to put, I'll put my highlighter on now. 
and I'm going for gold. So I'm going to put my highlighter on. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put my lipstick on. Hang on, I'm just getting it, girlies and boys. Is. I'm going to put my lippy on and then I'm going to put my highlighter on and then finish this video because I am vastly losing the light and it's sick, half past six. Time it is ticking on. Hang on, let me get a bit of highlighter. Put it there. Put it on the, on the nose. I'll do all that in a bit. Right, let's find my... What am I putting on tonight? I think I'll put something on that's going to really pop, pop, pop. But I need to find my lip liner. Where have you gone? Where have you gone? My favourite lip liner. Oh, I need that out as well. Where hath they gone? Oh, I don't know where it is. I just have to use one of these. It's not like using the other one though. Where's me other one? You m That's one of them. Oh, damn it is. Don't tell me it's gone west. Got it. <laughs> I will not be satisfied unless I use and it needs sharpening now. Oh my god. Everything's happening. Have you never done this where you've made a video and it's been a total disaster? Do you know, it, the better videos when the total disasters. <laughs> I've got to do my hair yet. And I've got about ten minutes. Oh my God. Please, please. Give me some time for losing the light. Oh God. Oh, I'll sort that out later. Right. Yeah. We're having um well I think we're having a coffee evening for Matt Mill in um for cancer next Thursday. I think so at Slimming World. So I'm gonna be baking. <laughs> I'm going to bake. I don't know yet. It's going to be a surprise. That's that. Uh, get off. Alright. There we go. Where's the plug? I can't find the lid. I'm wrapping this video up quickly. Anyway. It's lovely to talk about our old, our mums and, oh yeah, I've got that new one, haven't I? Oh, I could put the unique one on. You don't have to ask me twice. Oh, look at that. Splash. We're going for this. <laughs> Look at the colour. Oh, it's to die for. Thank you, Lisa. I love it. Oh, went a bit wobbly there. No, no, no. 
Quiet is stuff, Ben. I'm not even had to put it back in. That's how good it is. Just, it's amazing. I don't really want to go in the corners, but it's looking like I'm going to have to. I'll use a tissue. And do that thing what they call a with tissue if it gets too much but that's what it looks like anyway and I'll get me her done I'll get it struck and stick to that I am NOT going to slimming world with me her like that so I'll get me her done because I've done my roots so it's looking nice I'll get it done <laughs> Oh, and I'll get it done, and I'll sit. I'll take some some pictures. You got lipstick on my teeth now. Okay, girlies and boys, this. So, <laughs> oh God, I'm going. It's just been.